in second place in the NCAA 5K indoor. Uh, talk a little bit about going out with Emily Sisson early on and how that felt. Yeah, um, it felt good for the first few laps in the middle. I was definitely definitely feeling it. But um, yeah, that was kind of my race plan going in. I didn't want it to be a slow race. So I figured even like last year, it went out really, really slow. And my plan was just to kind of go out. If, if it went that slow, then just like me push the pace. And if it didn't, then just hang on to whoever was out in the front. So. How hard is it to stay engaged when you know she was pulling away from you with like 10 laps to go? How did yeah. you stay in the moment? Um, yeah, it was a little hard. Um, I really like to visualize like before my race and stuff, so I just kept saying to myself, you know, like run your rhythm, run your pace, you feel good, um, and just like keep positive thoughts going through my head instead of like, oh, she's, you know, getting out in front of me, can I hang on to this? And so I was able to still run a good pace and um, finish how I wanted to, so yeah. And then what are you hoping to do in the 3K tomorrow? Um, I'm just going to go out and try to run my best race. Um, we have another girl from Baylor, Maggie, that's going to run in it too. So I'm excited just to be able to have a couple of people out there representing Baylor. And um, we're just really blessed to be able to be here. And I'm so thankful that God's given me this opportunity. So Yeah, talk a little bit about, you have so many teammates here at this meet. So many yeah. Baylor distance runners. What's that yeah. like? It's so fun. Um, this year, I've had like the best training group ever, Alicia and Mariah and um, Maggie. And Mariah already qualified in the mile, and then our DMR is about to uh, go off. So I'm excited for that. And um, just having all that energy, you know, right before my race, Alicia qualified for the eight. So just like having some of my teammates and training partners qualify and do awesome. And then Trayvon just coming out and killing it. That It just feels so good and really powers me up. So, Congratulations. Yeah. Thank you so much. With uh, Emily having you know, such a fast seat time, were you satisfied with second? Or were you hoping you could have second? What was the answer? Yeah, I mean, of course, I'm always going into a race hoping that I can win it. Um, but I'm just really thankful for this opportunity, and um, I was happy with how I ended up. So.